Okay, so I'm going to show you how to export these videos uh, using Instagram settings on Adobe Premiere. So first thing is I have my uh, video cut down to 15 seconds. I know the in-class assignment will be 30, so um, go to File, Export, Media. Um, then what you're going to do is you're going to make sure that it says H.264 um, on the settings and you can go you can do match source for a high bit rate okay and you notice it says estimated file size 18 megabits so it should be between 20 you know, 5 and 20 at the most for this um, okay so now we gotta change the video settings so down here I'm gonna uncheck this and I'm gonna type in 640 by 640 okay and if you start scrubbing through you'll see that it's already created a letterbox Okay, so now I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to change the target bit rate to 5 and maximum bit rate to 5. Now, you can go a little bit higher now that Instagram takes uh, HD quality video. But for this, you're just going to go uh, 5 and 5. And you notice that my estimated file size is now 9 megabits. Okay, click over to audio. Change the sample rate to 44,100. And then you're going to change the channels to mono so that it just comes out of one. Um, both audio channels come out of um, both speakers the same, uh, not in stereo. Um, that's pretty much it. And so what I want to do now is I want to save this preset. So I click up here next to custom, click on save, and I'm just going to type in Instagram settings. And I'm going to just push OK. Oh, that already exists. So um, I'm going to change it to... Um, Instagram settings in class. You can name it whatever you want, but just something that you could find easily. Click OK. And so now, whenever I click on the format H.264, my custom presets are right here. So anytime I have a project that calls for Instagram settings, I'll be able to export it just by using mm -hmm. the preset. You push export. Make sure you've changed your output name to the last name, first name, and the project name. That's it. Thanks.